The tank of water has a specific gravity of 64.3 pounds per feet cubed. That's approximately salt water. Find the force of the water on face A. So here is the piece of the tank we want to actually find the force on. The force of the water will actually be approximately a triangular prism. That's the load intensity diagram that's going to be pressing on face A. Notice that the six feet is measurement is not going to matter at all because it doesn't matter how deep the tank is, how long the tank is. All that matters is how deep the tank is. If we look at only the two-dimensional version of this, the pressure at the top of the water is equal to zero. You can go two feet down, and the pressure at the bottom is the specific gravity times that two feet, which is 64.3 pounds per foot cubed times two feet, or 128.6 pounds per foot squared. Now, the total area of that triangle of the load intensity diagram is one-half base times height. That gives us something in units of pounds per foot. Keeping track of the units, make sure that you remember to multiply by your depth into the page. So your total force is 128.6 times 4. It's 514.